sudden it started to dawn on me like, no, he's serious. Because he sent me a, an email correspondence that, and I was like, uh, okay, I, it's, it just started to be serious. And, and uh, I was surprised, I think, you know. <laughs> Pleasantly surprised. So the John had some other stuff to do and I flew into town uh, for my 40th birthday party at Medieval Times and Jordan, my wife, was really good about it and she knew John was coming and I don't, I think she knew that John and Josh had never met so she seated John and Josh next to each other at Medieval Times for my birthday. <laughs> I was sitting right behind them like thinking that this is so perfect, you know, that our first band meeting is at fucking medieval times and I'm wasted, you know, I'm out of my mind drunk. I'll never forget, I turned to Dave and I was like, thanks man, you're a really good friend. Fucking yes. I, uh, I can't, if I, I couldn't even count how many bands have really met, not only started at medieval times, but met for the first time at medieval times. First of all, sitting next to any Englishman at medieval times Inherently, it's like, we're not all like this, you know. So then we came here to the studio and practiced for like three days. It was really weird because I had said to Josh, and I think I'd said to John too, um, I don't know how to start a new band. I haven't done it's it so in long. 15 fucking years, you know. <laughs> what do we do? And then we just kind of showed up and plugged in and just started playing. So it took a second to figure out what that is, like who who are, not who are we individually, but together. You know, I don't, we've been doing some killer stuff in here, but I don't even feel like we've scratched the surface. It's one of those things where if we had it, we'd never leave the fucking studio, you know? It has its own identity, it's its own personality. It looks, it looks unlike each of our other bands. It's a nice way of working. It's nice to be, to think of something and then go, Oh, let's put this down, you know, and then... But also, like, after a couple of weeks, from nothing, you've actually got tracks down yeah. in the can, which sound great, you know, it's like, wow, okay, this works. But at the same time, once you've figured that out, you know, there's stuff that's, that is the farthest out on the branch, out on the limb that I've gone in terms of just being vulnerable that whether it's musically, lyrically, whatever, it, you know, and that's where I think the good music is, is when, is when you understand you're so vulnerable that, uh, but it's okay, mm -hmm. you know? There's this great positive friction of what happens when everyone's trying to inspire the other person. I feel like it's gonna take us a long, I feel like it's gonna take more than one record for us to figure out what kind of band we are. And coming here and recording this, it's like, is this the most, awesome project I've ever done in my life? Yeah. But do I hope it's the most awesome band I'll ever be in? Yeah. I mean, it already feels like it to me. Is this, um, next to maybe Led Zeppelin, is this maybe the coolest band you've ever been in? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> no question. <laughs>